In this video, I will show you how to export your Amazon orders to uh, Google Sheet fully automatically without having to code, without having to know how to code, Python, etc. All with no code tools and in less than five minutes. So let's get started. For that, we will be using two uh, tools. The first one is Make, uh, formerly Integromat. So basically, Make is like uh, Zapier, is a tool that helps you connect multiple applications together to create uh, automation workflow. And uh, there is a free version uh, that lets you do up to 1000 operations per month. So you will have to subscribe to it, uh, to register to it for free. Then once you are logged in, you go in the scenario page and you create a new scenario. So in this scenario, what, what we want is to, uh, every time we have a new order on Amazon, we want to send it to this Google Sheet and to fill uh, some, uh, some rows with uh, order ID, SKU, uh, product name, price, etc. So first we will be adding a connector to Amazon data and this connector is DataMaze. So you will have to search for DataMaze. DataMaze is a private application at the moment I'm doing this video. So once you register on DataMaze, uh, you get uh, three, uh, three weeks without credit card, etc. So you can fully test it and uh, you get access to this application. So on DataMaze, you have this trigger, new Amazon orders. So basically it, it uh, allows to uh, get all your orders of the last uh, 24 hours. You click on it and you will have to add a connection. So once you create an account on DataMaze for free, uh, you go in the Make Integral Map page. You will see that there is a lot of features. Uh, there is automation, review automation, uh, PPC automation, analytics, etc. But we will be focusing on the Make Connector. So you go on the Mac connector, connector page, you will have to generate an API key. Once you generate it, you will be copying it, uh, never share it, never store it in a file or something because it will give make access to your Amazon uh, orders. So you don't want to, to share it. Uh, you add a new uh, connection, you put your API key, you put your, uh, your store name here. Let's say uh, you have a yoga brand. Uh, you save it, then you want to set the store ID. So in DataMaze, you can connect multiple stores. In this case, for example, there is two stores connected. I will select this one, the store ID, and I will paste the store ID just here. And I just have to save it and say that I want to get every order that I can. And I will connect that to a second uh, module which will be Google Sheet. So I just have to search for Google Sheet. Uh, each time I have a new order, I want to add a row. Uh, so same thing, you will have to connect your Google connection. I, I already done this, but uh, you will see that it's very simple. You just click on sign up with Google. Uh, you select the file that you want. So I will select mine. I put it in a folder called Test Amazon and the file is orders, which is this one, which is empty. Uh, you select the tab, the sheet is uh, the one. And then for each row, you want, you can select the, the data you want. So let's say the first one, we want uh, the Amazon order ID. Then here we want the purchase date, then uh, the order status, uh, the SKU, the quantity, the Uh, item price and the currency for example and here I want the city postcode and state in the same uh, column and I save it and that's it that's all you have to do from now everything will be synchronized automatically you just have to enable it by clicking here I can run a first test and uh, you can see that uh, now make is calling DataMaze to get the data and sending them to Google Sheet. I have 16 orders that have been added here. I can see them here. And uh, once I have enabled this, this will be done automatically every 15 minutes. This file will be filled with all my orders automatically with all the fields that, that I have set. That's it all in less than five minutes without any line of code. So I'll let you guys try. And if you have any question, let me know in the comment section below. See you. Bye.